What's up, Battle Camp? <clears throat> ben Benaki here. Come to you guys with a Crystal Siege hit, and we're hoping for the Water Crystal. Um, <laughs> and funny, you're probably going to see my chat head go, I don't know, insane this whole time because. Um, oh, I didn't get. Wait, what do we get? What do we got? Nope, we did not get the Water Crystal. So I'll just talk to you guys real quick because um, I'm going to be saving my 1,200, 1,202 energies for. The water crystal. Um, a lot of things going on. Uh, monster merging, like WTF. <laughs> um, <clears throat> yeah. So yesterday was a pretty crazy day. Um, monster merging kind of got unveiled for what it really is, and uh, the battle camp developers, along with the Facebook admin Yulun Y U L U N, decided to start going on a ban happy spree for people voicing their opinions on monster merging. Well. If you don't know much about monster merging, let me explain to you what it is. You may have heard in my videos before talking about how base damage is the only thing that event bonuses are based off of, which is true. And the only difference in variables that you would have in the past would be better than someone with the same team as you is these small little buffs like, oh, I don't know, Zodiac bonus, uh, passive level, um, those kind of things. And now... You can take, literally, you can take an event ultra with like, let's say a Dominion Ultra. Let's take a look at my Dominion Ultra. If I have this Dominion Ultra with 1,288 attack, I can merge another ultra with it with a higher base attack. I don't know. What's the highest base attack PE Ultra that you can think of? There's quite a few of them out there that are like, I don't know, 1,500 maybe? Could you imagine this monster with 1,500 attack? And that bonus, basically now I have an epic instead of an ultra, all because I merged something. Um, <clears throat> I find this to be extremely based on the, it's going to feed the whales. I mean, let's just, let's just call it what it is. It's going to make the people who spend more make even more. And it's gonna, it's just going to be a downward spiral. And the thing is, Battle Camp does this, I personally believe, because it's a marketing technique. I'm in marketing myself. I do that as part of my living. And it's very obvious to me that this is what's happening. Um, yesterday on Facebook, there was so much chat. I got banned from Global. And you know what? That's cool because Global obviously does not value people's opinions. Um, instead of just valuing your opinion, what they do is they just mute you, block you, or turn you off. And to me, that's really poor customer service. Um, that's terrible customer service. We're paying individuals. We spend money on this game. Uh, maybe not as much as these whales, but when we start to talk, uh, they can't just shut us down. I think that's complete and utter bullshit. Um, excuse my language. And for the most part, yesterday, <clears throat> everybody was pretty cool about it on the post. Nobody was uh, screaming profanity or acting crazy. Yet, you know, you get banned anyway. And to me, you know, guys, this is unacceptable. Um completely unacceptable on behalf of Battle Camp. Number one, to be launching a, another whale-specific feature in the game. But, you know, additionally, not even listening to anybody's feedback, just shutting us all down when 99% of people said, hey, you know what, guys? Uh, you know what, Battle Camp? This idea is complete and utter bullcrap. We are not interested in it. Why are you doing this? And, you know, no explanation. Not, not, they're not going to give us any real answer. <clears throat> I'm just going to start banning people. So, anyway, that's my... Uh, that's what I believe, and I'm no longer have a, a direct voice to BC Global, but I'm 99% sure this video is going to get posted to BC Global, um, just because I have the hashtag Battle Camp Army, and what hashtag Battle Camp Army is, guys, it's when everybody pulls together, and as an army, we're trying to change this game for the better. The developers need feedback, they just don't want it, because it means what, what they're doing could potentially be wrong, and that... Uh, Mistake. Nobody would like to admit that because, boy, oh boy, what would happen if we admitted we had a mistake? We'd have to fix something. <clears throat> Nobody wants to do that. So, my point is, guys, if you see this video and you feel the same way, I'd, I'd urge you to post it to BC Global. Let's show them what we can do because it's kind of BS that uh, that they're doing what they're doing. Boy, oh boy, that legendary team kicked my butt. Um, not really needing a gray room. Let's not go for that one. I didn't even notice that one had such high PR. But anyway... Let me guess, it's probably Legendary Monster Merge. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, I think Monster Merge would be really cool if they did it right. For example, they did not include event monsters. I think it'd be amazing for PvP because 
it's awesome that you could have a sleeper team. People would look at it and be like, whoa, it's a bunch of supers. How does he have 600,000 power rating, 800,000 power rating PvP? Well, that would be cool, right? But not for events, guys, because that's where that's where big spending happens. Like, that's it's irresponsible on, on Penny's behalf to, to kind of force this on us, in my opinion. Let me know what you think in the comments below, because... You know, I want. I think uh, we can get this video in front of the right people. We can get these posts in front of the right people and maybe make a difference. Maybe not. But at the end of the day, if something doesn't happen with Monster Merging, I know a lot of people that have considered like deleting their accounts, stuff like that. I am personally one who have considered like, not playing this game as much, putting it on the back burner and trying to stream something else. Um, just because it's going to get way too ridiculous soon or I'm not even going to be able to keep up with it as far as financially goes. Um, I personally believe that. Or I'll just be at the bottom of the barrel and I'll be spending what I can and that's just not fun to me. So, I don't know. <clears throat> Got a lot of mixed emotions about it. I'm not really happy with what the game is doing. I'm kind of bummed I also didn't get the right crest of the hit with you guys. But, I'll be back. Um, I will be playing the rest of this event, guaranteed. Spending my 1200 energy with uh, Elite Ghost. An amazing troop. Uh, they let me in right before all this drama. Uh, so they have nothing to do with my opinion whatsoever on Monster Merging. Um, but I just want to let you guys know that they're a great troop. And they're letting me join them for this Crystal Siege. Uh, Nuba Soul, who is um, also my buddy on Facebook. I'm not going to like disclose his name there. But he's an awesome dude, and he's got an awesome troop. He's let me in here a few times. Uh, once or A couple, one, couple times for CS and I think Dominion. But uh, anyway, thanks, thanks you guys for sponsoring me this event. Let me come in here. Um, I will be getting uh, probably a higher tier prize, especially once I start spending my energy. And the, I know for a fact uh, the troop's going to hit you know, Ultra. You can just see the rank now, and we just started, so 22. So hopefully I'll get some prizes that I can give away for you guys. Um, you know how to tell you what, if we blow this thing up, if we get, I don't know, if we get a Facebook post going, and uh, let's say we get this video, get some traction, um, we'll let you guys be the judge. and may give out one of the prizes from this event if we can just blow up enough traction around monster merging. Um, it's not going to matter to me. I'm not going to be monster merging these rewards because I think uh, I don't want to be doing it with PvP. I'm sure the event stuff, it just feels cheap to me. I don't I don't know. I don't want to do it. So what are your thoughts? I'm not going to ramble much more. Um, let's, let's, get this, uh, let's get this under control to where we can at least make sure everybody understands how we feel. Um, I'm not sure the developers will do anything. I'd be really surprised if they did. Um, they also might just come out and say, oops, we didn't mean to do that. <laughs> we weren't trying to put event monsters in there. It must have been a glitch. Um, like a lot of other things. But... Who knows? So enough of that. I'm going to end this uh, this video. Hope you guys got some insight out of that. Hope it wasn't too down on your luck kind of thing. But at the end of the day, it is what it is. And I hope I don't get too many thumbs down. Have a good one.